if someone were to say, hey, Dansby, what are two things that I can do to be a better fielder, develop my game defensively? The number one thing I challenge kids with, doesn't matter what age, is I always say, how many great plays do you see with two hands? The answer is zero, okay? The best way to catch a ground ball is with one hand. You have more range, you have more length. Watch, I get set up, I go to field a ground ball, this is as far as I can reach. I get set up in that same stance, and I go with one hand, I have about another you know, 10 to 12 inches of coverage, which allows me to play hops that I want to more often. Catching a ball with two hands is never a bad thing, but I do think the emphasis and being able to be comfortable catching the ball with one hand is paramount in the game of baseball. It's a one-handed game. So the thing that I would challenge young kids with is I say, okay, every fungo that we're going to take today, you have to catch it on the run with one hand. So whether that's me playing around a ball, whether that's me playing through a backhand on the run, even if the ball's hit right at me, so I want to go attack this ball and then, okay, I got to wait a second and then I can reshuffle to get the momentum that I want. Or if it's a forehand, playing through it on the run, two things it does. Number one, it helps kids realize that you have to attack the baseball because it shortens your throw. Your throw isn't gonna be as long and you can get more people out consistently. The second thing that I would say is it puts kids and anyone really in an uncomfortable situation to where they have to learn how to catch the ball with one hand. And until you're forced to do it, you're never gonna do it. But if you wanna be a great fielder, you have to learn how to play the ball with one hand. Absolutely. You got anything? Yeah, absolutely. Um, going to your backhand or your forehand, thinking about catching the ball with two hands is going to limit your wrench as well, mm -hmm. okay? Um, it's gonna be tough to create those angles that Densby, uh, that we focus on uh, on a daily basis here. So definitely be free mm -hmm. with one hand. Yep. One hand, the great ones filled with one filled hand. Filled with one hand. You know, coaches will probably give me some backlash for this. The point of doing this is to catch the ball, right? We talk about all the time, get, get in front, get in front. Getting in front doesn't always equate to making plays. However, when you attack the ball and you play the right hop, you're gonna make more plays. So do I wanna get out? Yes, what's the best way to get out? Play the ball, attack the ball, and usually, let's catch the ball with one hand. Either way.